We have designed a, a new Hawk collection, Crown and Diver. We can call it a sport, but in reality I prefer to say a lifestyle uh, uh, design on a Crown and a Diver watch. We try really to design something which comes from the roots of Jean Perregaux. There is the octagonal element, it's going back to the Laureato, which was introduced as the first octagonal watch in 75. On the diver, we keep the crown at 20 because this has been like a marked land for this collection and makes it as a diver completely different than other divers in the market. The case is very angular, but sits on the wrist in a very comfortable way. You really need to touch and feel and uh, put on your wrist and then you realize that uh, it's quite a well-balanced uh, construction and, uh, and watch. We are making uh, right now, I would say, an evolution for the company, bringing, uh, I would say, a, such a heritage uh, rich of history company to to the future, to, I would say, a little bit more modernity, design and the technology. The artisan work of the watchmaking is still there. It's not something from the past, it's something for the future. We have a lot of young people passionate in our company to create pieces for the future we like the idea to show to the people, okay, you see this tourbillon, here is the lady or the man who has done it. I think it gives a, a personal touch of, uh, to, to the company. Very soon, in a couple of months, we are going to present a new collection also with a different case, a different movement and uh, uh, many other projects on the high end. We are already working for 2015 and 2016. New technology, larger calibers, larger movement, lady watches. We're going in 2014 to have a completely new lady family of a round watch. I think everybody stick to a particular watch and doesn't wear other watches, even though maybe beautiful. And uh, to, to me, as much as a vintage 66 are really incredible classic and beautiful watches. I really stick on the WWTC and on the Sea Oak.